share this to the Discord. And, uh, other than that, Kyle, we are watching a movie called uh, Mutant. Um, nothing like uh, pick it from the shit pile, the old trusty shit pile. <laughs> I guess I need wrong. to have a more friendly, uh, family friendly name for it, but it's, I honestly, the shit pile is like, I don't know, it's a pretty, it's a pretty good name for me. No, I like it. Yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah, we just need another movie to watch. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. Uh, this is out of a yeah. collection of zombie, uh, zombie collection, and, uh, that, that's all I got, I guess that's all I got to say about it. Here we go. Um, I do need to plug my headphones in. I guess it's good. When is Hassa? See, I've seen his son in a lot of stuff. Bo Hopkins related to Anthony Hopkins? Kind of looks like a 90s movie. A little bit. So I told you I was playing like Final Fantasy and I was like watching some on the. Uh, what was it? Mississippi Burning? And, yeah, yeah. Um, whatever. I was watching this movie. You ever heard of a movie called Hard Rain? Have you ever heard of this? Morgan Freeman's a bad guy in it. I haven't finished watching it. Oh, this movie is... Okay, I have I have seen this, actually. Yeah, um... How can I put it? It's, it's like... It's not garbage. It's not garbage. I was gonna say, I saw this. I've always... This, these are VHS tapes my dad always had. Mm -hmm. And, um... I've never seen... This ever on TV. I've never seen is this it? anything. And... I took this movie very seriously, and I started watching the first twenty minutes of this. And I'm like, this is kind of goofy. A little bit. <laughs> it's like it's it's like for the normal audience, it's goofy. But if you watch shit movies like these, it's not that bad no, like, so like, far. Like, like, like I said, it's not it's not a, a top it's a goofy movie. concept. But, but it, like, it's I mean on our rating system, if you were to put it into a good rating, yeah, it's, uh, it'd, be, it'd be like a. But I haven't finished it yet though. But seeing Morgan Freeman as a bad guy, it really threw me off. It was good. Like the first like, scene with him in it, he writes on a piece of paper like "I will kill you" on it, and I'm like, ah, that's a good joke. And I'm like, he's fucking serious. Yeah, no, like, it's actually like, <laughs> there's far worse action movies you could watch. It's kind of a heist. He actually. it's the only movie I could think of where Morgan Freeman's actually yelling. Excuse me, like he's really. I mean, like. The story, you know, I think what it is, the story is original. Like, you know, it's so, it's raining so bad, like a town's getting flooded, and that's when people decide to do a heist. It's mm -hmm. pretty original. But the execution is, like, reminding me a little bit of Waterworld. <laughs> like, just them doing jet skis through a high school and everything. Yeah, I mean, that's not what we It's like, let's throw in an action sequence. So many people hated Waterworld. I actually, I gotta be yeah. honest, I kind of liked it. Yeah. Like, this, it, was, it wasn't phenomenal, but I thought it was Yeah, cool. it was a Mad Max, but it was no, better no, than no. Warriors of the Wasteland. Why does that guy have a slice in his palm? I don't know. He's got, like, a cut in the palm uh, of his hand. I hope this is, like, carnage, but... The, what the... He's getting choked by... He looks Some like... chick. No, it looks like old Greg. You remember? You ever oh, see the God. old Greg videos? Yes. That's what it looks like a whoa, silhouette whoa. of. He's oh, smoking. Smoker's cough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why he's gonna use the night boys. <laughs> Those Marlboro. Is that a Mustang? I think so. I'm not a car person, but what the hell? Headphones just drive. Are just drive a car and wear headphones. Josh, where are we? How crappy is your car that your radio... <laughs> he's, like, he's like, do you not hear your muffler going up? I can't hear a thing. <laughs> Relax, right? Relax. Look, oh. I know we're watching a movie right now. I drug you out of the city to get you away from all... He drugged you to, to relax, take you out of the city. All your problems, your troubles. Especially that, uh, that beautiful little girl who dumped you. I'm so sorry about oh, that. Oh, come right? on. That is not even the point. That's not what I'm talking about. She didn't dump me. Right? We just have Cheeto. We just have Eric and Sullivan. What the fuck is that? Good word. Josh, could you please keep your eyes on the road, okay? You just you're making me nervous. I could drive. But they had like the ultimate collection of like well, late nineties movies. Like I've never even heard of this movie. 
Mark last Mark. night, oh, oh no. Last Light with I'm Keith Sutherland and Forrest God. Whitaker. I've never heard of Ooh, this before. Good actors. That's what I'm saying. Like, Forrest Whitaker. These are amazing. movies I never, like, I'm like, Dad, where did you get these? Yeah, this is not something I've ever seen. I, and I like Oh, something's Whitaker. going on in the movie. He drove on the opposite side of the road? You just nearly got us killed. What did I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you know, the funny, the funny thing is, like, I say I like Forrest Whitaker. I think the last time I saw him in a movie was, like, Species. Oh, God. Yeah, you haven't even seen his actual, like... Oh, you know what? There was a movie my mom and I watched where he was, like... He was, like, locking these people up in his basement. <laughs> Let me look this up. Whoa, what the hell? Ooh, angry rednecks. Ooh. Oh, come on. You gotta, like, fuck up his car like that? Jesus. This is the guy with the beat up truck. <laughs> Dude, you're in a Mustang. Floor it. You can outrun their pickup. <laughs> yeah, seriously. It's not like to be. This is trying to be like. Oh, that's not a Mustang, though. But yeah. That looks like a Pontiac SS. What the hell? What the. I really wouldn't have heard the angry rednecks like that. Hit your brakes. They just fight him for no reason. <laughs> just breaks. You oh, break. so Forrest Whitaker's in that Battlefield Earth movie? <laughs> oh, that movie, oh god. <laughs> he was in Bloodsport? I've never seen Bloodsport. I've never seen it. Wait, hold it, wait. This, uh, or John, John Connor. Van... Yeah. I saw it once. Can't remember anything. Oh, it's this movie. Repentance. Repentance. Mm -hmm. Never seen that one. I think there's. Yeah. He gets caught up about it's a weird movie. Years after a drunken car crash that took his life, there's gonna be a town. Uh, somebody reinvented themselves as a therapist and advisor and religion and positivity. He's para. I hate this vocation and so successful book. Trouble man. Say he's probably in a hurry to help somebody, huh, Mike? Come on. I think somebody writes a book about a car accident, and then the guy in the forest would occur goes crazy and locks him up and shit. And then he finds out that his mom was the one that died in the car accident with him, I think is how it went. That was weird. Let me, uh, let me stop this one. You just sit it out. Been nice knowing you. Knowing how the people have been, I'm pretty sure that guy won't stop. <laughs> okay. And the guy stops anyways. What was the point of that? What is this guy doing? Shoot him. Shoot him. He does have a gun rack. <laughs> oh, this is the South. Oh, God. Was it Billy? Was it budget Billy Bob Thornton? You all alright? I wouldn't get in a car with that guy. Yeah, I'm fine. That's good. Is that your little car back down there in the water down the road? Yeah. Unfortunately, we uh, we ran into some of your local heroes here. You know where there's a gas station? Yeah, there's one in Goodland. Uh, of course, it's two, three miles from here. Today you hop in, and I'll take you to it. My name's Mel. <laughs> <laughs> You sit next to him, alright? Yeah, the, the sad thing is, <clears throat> I've watched so many bad movies. Yeah, this I is actually a lot of positive things to say. Like, oh, the acting's not terrible. <laughs> no, I know, right? The uh, camera shots aren't bad. It's in Zoom. You know, like, it's. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> 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 
That's not a cigar, that's a cat turd he's chewing on. <laughs> <laughs> it's rock salad for three days. <laughs> so I have a feeling there's a reason why those people attacked his vehicle to chase, kind of chase him out. But I think their goal of having them stuck there wasn't as planned. <laughs> Isn't a great idea. I don't think they thought it through. I'm getting kind of a, what is it, Jeepers Creepers vibe out of this? That, oh, that's what I was, I tried to think of what, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's it. Because they did get chased out. What yeah, did you by, think of Jeepers Creepers, the first one? It's a good movie. Yeah. I liked it. Yeah. I watched it as a, it's one of those movies you watch it as a kid, you didn't really watch it as an adult. Mm-hmm. It's pretty good for a modern horror. Like, it stood out. The second one, I liked it as a kid, and then I thought about it. It's just another slasher movie, mm-hmm. basically. Yeah. Just a bunch of high school kids stuck in a bus, and then they get killed. The only cool part was was the farmer guy that just sits there and watches. Yeah. That's the coolest shit. You know, I, I like that's from a storytelling perspective. Yeah, and, and I didn't see the third one because that was third? like a made for TV. I think it's like a sci fi original. Oh, oh, yeah, that's real. It's, it's kind of it's, it's like a made for TV one. Basically, that's really terrible. Jesus. It's sad that sci fi pretty much is where movies go to die now. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, that, that used to be a place where it's like, yeah, good little bunch of films. Not anymore. <laughs> you know, the thing was, sci-fi was the channel to go to, to for me. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, I'm going. Um, so the sci-fi channel was like a, a good channel to watch horror films. Like, they would actually show some, like, decent oh, horror no, oh, films. Oh, yeah, no, absolutely. From what I remember, you know, when, you know, back in the day when uh, I was a kid it, and there was cable. If you, if you horror but horror now films. it's like, it's the shit. Movies no, now, like it's, literally, not, not good. Like, yeah, like, just, th- like if what we do is a channel, that would be it. <laughs> We're a little bit better. We don't take like they take themselves seriously. We don't. <laughs> yeah, like scare tactic. Or, like scare tactics was a fun show to watch. But, like no, like with like sci-fi. Like it used to be like sci-fi and TNT is where you went for horror movies. Yeah, back in the day. and AMC when it was uh, yeah, like Halloween Monster Vision. Yeah, yeah. When it was yeah TV, you know, TNT, it, TNT. Uh, but uh, they do uh, AMC's. Uh, Fear Fest. Okay. But they um, put, like, the last time I watched it, they did it halfway through October. I'm like, guys, what the fuck? Start this shit in September. But, but The Walking Dead started on Halloween Day. Like, that was the first uh, pilot aired. Oh, who is this guy? Uh Uh-oh. Did this guy just get murdered? What is he doing? He got choked and murdered? Oh, no. He he might be choking something. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, yeah. So there's a guy just walking around, just passing out, just, bur- <laughs> just passing out sulfuric acid. Man, these fucking Avon ladies are going nuts. <laughs> <laughs> that place has Budweiser, so I can go over there. But yeah, I told you, I was like, I bought cans. Because I was like, ooh, Budweiser, I had a bunch of Bud uh, bottles. And I was like, uh... What was it? I had a bunch of Bud bottles, and I was like, "Oh, this!" Is, I was like, "Budweiser's a lot better than I think it is." So I was like, "I wanted it," but I was like, "I don't want to buy bottles because it'll just sit over there." And I was like, "Let me buy cans." And I'm like, "It's not the same. It's really not." <laughs> Come on, Bob. What the fuck? Come on, generic guy. <laughs> There's probably a cat that just put acid don't in some Don't investigate noises in strange towns. Yeah. Get in and get yeah, out. somewhere where you're not even. Native to, we're familiar with. Is this gonna be like the pit where people just fall into shit? I hope so. It's just a dead hobo, God. You see this in New York all the time. Is that the dad from Red Dawn? Oh God! Avenge me! What There's the chain link fence. What did you think of Red Dawn? You know, I love that movie as a kid. It was the, it was like the the most action movie I could watch as a kid, mm-hmm. next to Commando. And uh, you know, even though I grew up in like the early two thousands, I still feel like a kid from the eighties. Wow, he mutated really fast. Oh, Jesus. He got a herpes on his cheek. STDs, kids. Yeah, stay away from them. Don't touch hobos. Ooh. Don't touch dead homeless guys. Um, 
Yeah, just roll back over. <laughs> it's just yeah. like we're not gonna we're gonna act like we didn't see that. <laughs> yeah, go get yourself some booze. <laughs> you need a couple. Of that. Oh god. Oh, a jukebox player. Oh, but right down. Um, yeah, no, I really loved Red Dawn, and as I got older, I realized how ridiculous that movie is. Friends. And then I realized how, like, also, like, pretty accurate how the situation probably would have played out if there was a world war. Or even, like I said, with what's going on right now, the way they go back to the city and, like, people are, you know, that are native, they're kind of, like, living a normal day life, but they're really under a, a military control. Yeah, yeah. It kind of reminds me of, like, when I went on vacation and I came back and, like, everybody's, like... You know, we, we open at this hour, we open, we close at this hour. Oh, there's so many people in the building. It's, it, it's not exact, but it's, it gives you an idea of what mm-hmm. it could be like. Okay, Albert, back off. The remake was not too bad. I'm near on a good pickup with that I think I still prefer the original, but the remake really... It, it's, it's, a, it's, it's a worth a watch, I, I guess. It's not terrible. That's my brother. Huh? When will I trouble, all right? I want to make a phone call and get out of town, right? Oh. Well, you boys He's got an RC Cola hat. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking ass. it was like a beer hat. It's like RC Cola. No. We, don't, we don't drink Coke yeah. and Pepsi around here. <laughs> <laughs> Just RC. We drink the good stuff. <laughs> Next to the Confederate, double Confederate. Oh, <laughs> they couldn't make these guys more stereotypical. <laughs> you, you see Their the whole, kids are protesting Look at right the display now. of pork rinds in the background. Come on. And is that the bad guy from uh, Flash Gordon? It might be. You gonna eat some steel. What do they do? <laughs> These people show up. Oh, he wasn't shot. He was stabbed. All right. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Oh, nice. Wow, oh, you, you broke got him. Stick. You got him. They they have like two Miller signs too. We only drink RC and Miller. <laughs> it's Miller time, boy. What? Ooh. Ooh, nice. Does that fish mounted on the background talk? Oh, the Billy Bass. <laughs> Look at the bartender. He's having a good time. He's like, you guys breaking my shit, but that's funny. <laughs> so, yeah. He's like, oh, they grabbed the bartender's beer, man. That's not that cool. <laughs> what do these people do? <laughs> they show up to this. They I don't get, just, are they just angry rednecks? Is yeah. that it? <laughs> Are these people secretly black and we just don't know it? Like, like, is it like the opposite of white chicks? Is it like know? they live and they can see that they're aliens and we oh, don't know? We don't like your kind around here. Wait, what does that say? Be nice to a bartender? Okay, well, fuck the fuck the outside city folk. Get, I screwed up in big city. Get, that looks like a fat Dennis Quaid. <laughs> And that guy, the sheriff, looks like if uh, you got, you got something for this? James Dean was still alive at this time. He looks a lot like James Dean. He looks familiar, that's for sure. Excuse me, sheriff. But we he looks like, because with the hat, he looks like James Dean from the movie Giant. Have you seen Giant? It's, uh, it's, it's one of those old classic movies that's like really good. But it's like three hours. Jesus! For a 1950s movie, that's, that's like a an ass movie. that's like a day. <laughs> like, that's a long ass movie. But it's great. It's Rock Hudson, um, uh, uh, Elizabeth Taylor. So it's it's got a strong cast. It's it's a great movie. Oh yeah, there's like sheriff. We got a dead body over here. <laughs> oh come on! He mutated to a new person. I thought I was home. That's funny. <laughs> this is Ronnie Dangerfield. <laughs> <laughs> no respect. We recast no respect. them. No respect to the homeless. <laughs> you know what, kid? You're all right. <laughs> He's just cracking jokes on the way back to the station. Uh, no, but seriously, these people get ran off the road. That is not the same guy that was there. I'm like, knock it off. But God, he's not about to believe you, right? Damn right. I got enough problems around here without you people. Now, I don't know what, what do you mean, you peoples? Here. Now, I'm taking you to get your arm fixed, but I want you people to leave first thing tomorrow. You got me? Yeah, yeah. Best advice I've heard all day. Huh? Thanks a lot, Sheriff. Let's go, Mike. Mike? Sheriff, I... Let's go, boy. Let's go. Come on. 
What's the thing in his back pocket? Oh, that's like a holster and some bullets. Yeah. I, I saw it as oh, like... Oh, oh man, he's Oh, shit. butterscotch pudding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, I love butterscotch. Oh, dude, fuck yeah, butterscotch. I remember being in like third grade and like they'd, uh, you know, you get candy or whatever and the teacher gave us like the hard candy yeah. butterscotch. Oh, oh man, yeah. that shit was good. Oh, dude, what was it? Yeah. Was it oatmeal cookies with butterscotch chips? Oh, oh, oh shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was another thing. Kids hate oatmeal cookies, I but I fucking it. loved oatmeal cookies. Dude, they're cookies. amazing. Especially with raisins. Oh, dude, for like raisins or cinnamon in them and shit? Yeah. Oh, God. Kids just, just hate them. I'm like, <laughs> Losers. Well, uh, actually, the sheriff here seems to think we should get on out of town. Yeah, he's only right there. You know, you don't have to talk <laughs> like him in third person. Okay. Okay, this is going to sound like a dumb question, but why do they have the eye chart in the hallway? Like, you're not going to stand that far from it when you're in a hallway. <laughs> this is old world medicine, Austin. <laughs> like, it makes sense if it's right behind the sheriff, but they really put it in the hallway. They're like, just stand two feet away from it. <laughs> Better lighting. Jesus. Sheriff. Well, I hate to bother you, but I was wondering if I might ask you a favor. I know you don't like to ask favors. Maybe if you were off the juice, you wouldn't have to. Not the kind of favor. I like my juicy juice. Besides, what's between us was over three months ago. Good thing he didn't say nine months ago. <laughs> like, that would have been... <laughs> That's not my baby, you know, Mo. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason we're alone is because people don't want to come to a small-town, old-fashioned doctor who also just happens to be a woman. My regulars are canceled. Yeah, what's up with that? Why is it so old-fashioned to want a man doctor? No. Like, I want a man to touch my balls and put a finger in my ass and do my colon check. <laughs> it's just the country way, damn it. <laughs> like, I don't know why. Because I thought that when, I don't know if you ever watched The Ranch. Like, do you have Netflix? I have not watched The Ranch. Okay. I have no. If you like that 70s show, and I know you do, uh, oh, yeah. The Ranch is like a good, like, I like guess spinoff. It's the same cast. What the hell? That's a cigarette burner. <laughs> Or a cigarette lighter from a car. I look away for two seconds and he pulls that thing out of his ass. Prison wallet. You can hide it. <laughs> yeah, I know. He's like, ah, shit, it's getting too hot. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. Uh, but no, the range is pretty good. Um, but it's it's got, you know, it's got Danny Masterson and Ashton Kutcher from... Uh, oh, shit. From, Ashton Kutcher's hit Miss for me. From that, yeah. from that 70s show. Yeah. And it's got the same vibe as that 70s show, just in the country. And, um... Oh, by the way... Uh, uh, God damn it. I can't think of his name. Probably because I'm drinking. Uh, Frogs. The actor in Frogs. Sheriff. The lead actor? Yeah. Oh, okay. You gotta believe me that we're the same man. Oh, oh God, what's his name? Son of a bitch. I told you to drop it. How do you want to stand son of a bitch? I can't remember his name. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm like, I'm gonna rewatch this video and I'm gonna be pissed at myself. What the hell him. is. Oh my god, the pre Elliot dad. Smith. Thank you, Elliot he, uh, Smith. He, he's the dad in it, and he's kind of like the Red Foreman, like a country Red Foreman. <laughs> so it's it's pretty good. That's awesome. And uh, eventually, Fez comes on. The guy that plays Red comes on. Uh, the the mom that plays Kitty. Oh God! Wait, is she the? But God, we're sorry to. Is that the mutant? <laughs> <laughs> is that what? I... Sheriff Stewart. Yeah. She's got the eyes. <laughs> like, it's a chick of some kind doing this to people. This is Nick, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm John. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is my brother Mike. Our car broke down, and uh, we just need a place to stay. To be gone first thing in the morning, I found Oh, you can stay as long as you like. Make yourselves at home. Thank you. You think it would have been nice for the sheriff to stick around and tell tell old lady, hey, I checked these guys out. They're not complete psychopaths. <laughs> Just showing up to your house in the middle of the night. It's country. You want to understand, Kyle? This is entirely possible. <laughs> I still change the sheets right regular though. I did shit on them the other day. <laughs> <laughs> the cats piss on them a lot. <laughs> See, as I have thirty-two of them. 
one bed. They're gonna have to spoon. <laughs> It's like the scene from, uh, oh god, what was the picture that used to be there? <laughs> you don't want to know. <laughs> Those are my centerfold days. That's very nice of you. How much do we owe you? Just $15. And you can pay it when you leave. <laughs> Who knows? You might stay longer than you planned. Oh, foreboding. Yeah. I told you. Yeah. I told you. <clears throat> Me. Oh, it is. This was Suicide Kings. Okay. No, she's. You really can't. God, that's a. The sad thing, that's a really good cast. Yeah. Like a really good cast. It's a great movie. Low rating for some reason. I know there's a lot of good movies that have low ratings. Yeah. To be honest. It's a good movie. And there are people that think Ghostbusters 2016 is phenomenal. <laughs> <laughs> Who, Kyle? Who? <laughs> <laughs> like, not to be honest. Not to be um, sour, I guess. No, I'm sure I'll be fine. This time. Ghostbusters to me is okay. I watched it as a kid. I don't have the same spark to it as a lot of people do. It's it's original. You make me sad. I like it for what it is. You make me sad. <laughs> it's, it's nowhere near a bad movie. What is that guy? Just a quarantine guy just walking now, around? No, for clarity's sake, I'm, I'm guessing you feel the same way about this like I do towards certain movies where it's like, I can respect it, but it's not my thing. I mean, it just doesn't hit my nerd button. Okay, for, okay, I, I'll, I'll roll yeah. with that. I'll roll with like, that. I love, I love Bill Murray. Dan Aykroyd, you know, that old 80s humor. <laughs> it gets funny in the Just knock there. on He's the like, door. He's like, hey! <laughs> it's not funny, Josh. It's the second time in the night. What, that you shit yourself? I mean, you only got stabbed by a redneck. Nice, this is all right. How do you rate this? I got, uh, posturpedic concrete. Yeah, let the guy who got stabbed sleep on the hardwood floor. <laughs> Look, man, you know that was not the same body we saw. Clearly he was elected to be the shirts off throughout the entire movie, guys. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> the guy has no eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> We're just going to close our eyes and forget the whole thing, is that it? Yeah, that's how he went through his uncle raping him. <laughs> he just closed his eyes and forgot the whole thing. <laughs> oh, Tom, how's it going? No, um... Huh? We don't know what this movie is. We we have another movie planned, but the other movie seems decent, so we decided to pick a movie from the ship pile. And this is what we picked. It's a movie called Mutant. And it's, um... These guys are just getting harassed by country folks. And Pretty it's, much. They, they witness the body, and they call the sheriff after a bar fight, mind you. Yeah. And the guy was okay, but it was a different person. And that's all we got to say. There's, I promise you, it's, it's, you didn't really miss a whole lot. <laughs> we don't know what to expect from this. Um, the next movie we're watching is called Six Days in Roswell. It's actually a documentary about a guy who goes to Roswell for the 50th anniversary from the crash um, incident. And he just shows how ridiculous people take the alien thing in Roswell. And it, I watched the first 10 minutes of it. It's pretty, it's pretty funny. So if this is a doubt, at least we know we have a decent movie to follow. The new medical center? Oh god, that has nothing to do with the plot. <laughs> it's like there's a quarantine. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
rats in this place are huge. <laughs> it just shows Brad Jeremy just as a rat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'm in the wrong movie. <laughs> Ron Jeremy, you're in the wrong movie. This is this is mutant. You're looking for mountain. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. shit! Sorry. Don't do it. Don't oh do no, it. not this thing. Is it going to be a clown? <laughs> is it going to be a clown? Oh no. Okay. Then we look This is there. this is when he gets killed. Is when there's not. Oh <laughs> wait, what the? <laughs> What the hell? So there was something. <laughs> oh no, he's gonna get raped like in Cry How Wilderness. How the hell did it? I am. So, oh, I have questions. I have questions. This is actually, uh, this is actually less like Poltergeist and more like Scary Movie Two. Yeah, they, <laughs> yeah. Take it to the head. <laughs> oh, God. This? oh no, this is Little Monsters. He went down in the monster world downstairs. Do you remember that movie, Kyle? Oh, I've never seen that. Little Monsters with uh, Freddy Savage and uh, Howie Mandel. I don't think I've seen it. Howie Mandel plays as a monster. Dude, it's a good 80s kids movie. Um, I don't know. Freddy Savage plays as a little kid. And the monster comes from underneath his bed and fucks all his shit up in the house. And um, so he catches him. Then he finds out between a certain time under his bed, there's a whole world of monsters underneath his bed. So it's like a whole new world, basically. He just goes underneath it and transports him to, like, this monster world. It's actually a pretty good movie. Like, I'd watch it sober. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Tom. Tom remembers that. Yeah, dude, it's really good. How, I didn't even know it was Howie Mandel for the longest time. Wait a minute. Okay, so that bed was... Sorry. It's like, that bed was destroyed, and she didn't mention it at all to him. Wait, it was destroyed? Because he was tearing the sheets and whatnot. Like, he, yeah, this, like, all his, she's in on it. She's like, well, it looks like I'm going to Goodwill for his own nation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's, oh, God. Wait. This is like, what was that movie with Queenie in it that we watched? Queenie? Steve McQueen? No, Queenie. It's in the crazy old lady's sister. Bunch of rednecks in the woods. Oh god, I can't remember the name of it. Oh, uh, Mother's Day. Yeah, it's like that. It's like the prequel. This is the story of Queenie. <laughs> oh shit, she's a could be. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the town's all boarded up. What the fuck is going on with this town? But the bar's open. The bar's always open. Essential business <laughs> with essential employees. Jesus, how many Confederate flags do they have? <laughs> I thought it was just two. Not enough. Not enough, Not brother. Not enough. <laughs> They're actually in Wisconsin. <laughs> 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 That's the plot twist. It's Milwaukee's best. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. You interrupted? Yeah. The bar's always open. My brother. About 20 years old, brown hair. No, we don't got any of that. You want some Milwaukee? <laughs> I've been in here all day. Can you go for young boys or go somewhere else, sir? We probably want the gas station and tow truck. Our car's in the ditch outside of town. She's got wild turkey. Mm. I've never had wild turkey, so I can't I haven't either. Right. I've heard good things. Oh, but there's another gas station on the outskirts of town. It's probably open. Well, thank you. It's about four or five miles. Four or five miles, I see. It's about five to twelve miles. Yeah. <laughs> Any kind of public transportation in this town? You're not from around here, are you? Oh, no. Oh. Looks like they got a lot of Evan Williams in the back. Okay. I think that's what that is, Evan Williams. I can't tell. There's a lot of old labels there. Right. Listen, uh, the gas station's not far from where I teach. I'm gonna go pick up some papers, so... If you want, you can come along. So you're a teacher and you tend bar. This is a small town. 
<laughs> I teach my kids math problems through beer. <laughs> Respect. <laughs> Where do you think 99 bottles of beer on the wall? Yeah, you know? it explains what... <laughs> <laughs> I love the giant sign that says MasterCard. <laughs> oh, God. No. Is this softcore porn again? Oh, God. I swear oh, to God. God. It's, it's going to be like uh Bloody Ape. Yeah. <laughs> All over. It's like, ah, oh, God. Holly. I sure would appreciate a ride at that gas station. She'd appreciate a ride. Oh, uh, she's making Bloody Marys. I was looking to say that. <laughs> That's bloody all right. That's totally, <laughs> v, that's totally V8. There's <laughs> some McClure's. <laughs> Good stuff, I hear. Okay. Drink it. What? Oh, it is Bloody Mary. My father's famous hangover antidote when he was GP 30 years ago. <laughs> his, hangover, his hangover antidote is a Bloody Mary uh, <laughs> without liquor. <laughs> Virgin Bloody Mary. Uh, that's funny. Extra virgin. I'll have a wine spritzer, spritzer, spritzer. <laughs> I think Tom might get that reference. Last night I ran some tests on that serum you gave me. Yeah, it was and you're not gonna believe. Any oh any word from uh, Mel or John? Mm -mm. They may be distracted at the moment. Well, yes and no. I mean, but they're more of Saturday people. Yeah, Saturday right, she's, still doing the, she's doing the teaching thing still, so she's probably doing it all of her right. work-related items. Oh, it was a Simpsons reference, Tom. It's when Homer and uh, Ned go to Vegas, and and Ned goes, what the hell, I'll have a drink. And he goes, I'll have a wine, spritzer, spritzer, spritzer. <laughs> And apparently they go on the bench. <laughs> it absorbed it and grew. I mean, it must have increased the mass. It was three times the size. He's like, honey, I don't understand a single word. <laughs> Small words, short sentences. Over to the county medical center right now. Uh oh. Did the stool samples escape? <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Turd monsters. Yeah, what the fuck happened? Who got, the? To the, who got to the blood, Gary? Oh, God, it's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck? Did a crackhead bust in there and steal the blood samples? <laughs> what the fuck happened? I have questions about this. Uh, Tom's a big uh, fan of the thing, too. Thing He's one of the people that can just watch that movie a hundred times. Oh, the indecisive artist. That's an oh, one. okay. So I was like, who? Huh? It's not a Meyer employee that I haven't met yet. I guess I just want to say. So anyhow, I was just uh, kind of going out of my mind looking at some of the great things. I thought it was time to take a little R and R. Well, you might get some rest and but I don't know about the recreation. This isn't the gas station. No, it is not. <laughs> I'm just gonna be a minute. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. <laughs> <laughs> That's your whole class right there. He's like, am I going to see your boobs today? <laughs> That's Bruno. <laughs> Dude, this is the pit. <laughs> so, uh, camp disappears. Nobody's at home. My mom and dad are gone. What the? They left me for good. Well, that dude, dude here's, we're introducing you to your new daddy. Oh, God. They probably just went out shopping. They'll be back. <laughs> That's what he said. Uh, <laughs> 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 oh, God. The oh, top no. says you can't prove that. You only watched it four times last month. Come on. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. I miss Paris. Goodbye. Wait, a kid tells you that they've been abandoned. You're saying, ah, just go home. It's the 80s. It was normal. True. True. Honestly, that was probably, you know, SOP. Well, I don't want to see average white woman Karen's boobs. That's what I'm saying, Steve. Main star of everything. Listen, uh, I, find I have to translate names to you. I uh, forget. Thank you. Thank you. Well, there's a couple of people I don't know them by their actual name. That are users. Oh, here we go. Mysterious death incoming. Look at that projector screen. You remember those? Oh, fuck yeah. Nobody else is here but us in the school. 
<laughs> and that kid that you just sent out on his own, don't forget that. <laughs> you if your parents are there, just put a toaster in the microwave. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I don't know what I meant by this. Shit, I like <laughs> it, it though. It started out one way and ended a different way. That was great. Put toast from the microwave. <laughs> what the hell? Wait. Wait, did she just... Hold on, Kyle. I'm trying to put this movie together. This lady's a bartender in the morning. <laughs> and a teacher by night. <laughs> like, I'm assuming this is like... 11 o'clock in the morning? Yeah. Noon? Yeah. And she left a bartending job to go to a school <laughs> where the, apparently there was one kid. <laughs> he was like, he was like, teacher, I'm the only one that stayed. <laughs> I can't wait, wait, movie. wait, wait, wait. Oh, shit's going down. Oh, oh the, globes. He literally dropped the world. <laughs> oh, dead body. Is oh, that, is the, that kid. the kid? Is oh, that no, the kid? it's a different kid. Oh, what no, it is a different kid. It had to be a black kid. The one black kid in the Alabama town. Oh, God. Chief Redneck. I'm down here, city boy. I said get the sheriff. Look at this girl. <sighs> yeah, she's off for dinner, right? <laughs> talking about what I've done. Well, you know I didn't... Did? Didn't what? Dennis Quaid's fucking mad. You reckon anybody down here don't believe you, city boy? Come on. It is, uh, what happened to the girl? Tom? What does he have, a ruler? The yardstick. You know we do the child killers around here. <laughs> oh, there goes the water system. I see a rape coming. It is giving me some Shawshank Redemption vibes. Uh huh. <laughs> he likes to smack pipes. He's a, I'm a pipe smacker, that's what I do. Your pipe is next, boy. What is this, like, Star Wars budget style? <laughs> <laughs> this is right next Star Wars right here, boy. This is plumbing. Don't hit the pipe, hit his fingers, you dumbass. Yeah, he's like, I'm just going to keep on hitting the pipe until you die. Oh, God, there's a gas leak. <laughs> oh, God, vapor. <laughs> Water <Jeez>. vapor. <laughs> You either oh. get busy. You either, God damn it, Tom. You either get busy raping or get busy dying. You give me such a hard time for it. He stole my Rita Hayworth poster. That's a lie. Yeah, where did she go? You were nowhere. And the body fell, and she's like, I'm out. <laughs> the both of you is. They never specified what state this is in. Oh. Sheriff, I'm sure he didn't do it. I'm sure. Well, I already heard you, Holly. But if he's so innocent, why did he run away? Maybe because, because I had to go. Yeah, well, maybe because I had to go back to the bar. No, but seriously, this bitch. Yeah, why don't you go home? I got enough problems. Every place is closed. Mm -hmm. The guy shows up to the bar, and she's like, "I'll take you to the school." <laughs> no, what she said. Was I work at a school? Uh -huh. I'll take you to the gas station. Well, she she just had to pick up some papers. Yeah. So I was like on the way. Here, I, uh... Goes to the school in the middle of the day and just surprised to see a kid there. And the kid's just like, "Hey, everybody left. I'm still here till uh, yeah. three o'clock." She's abandoned. like, "Go home." <laughs> my, my parents abandoned me. Just go home. I'm sure they'll be there. Oh God, the one black cop in the whole. <laughs> He's gonna die. It's the 80s. Don't go to the bar with the Confederate flag. He's already dead. He's already dead. He's like, oh, I know about that place. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah Steve, you probably missed it, but the bar has like 10. Oh, God. It flies like 30 Confederate flags. This is the wonderful cotton picking state of Alabama, Tucky. <laughs> cotton picking, literally. Uh. I literally just got done watching uh, Mississippi Burning. <laughs> Good movie. The one photographer in the town. No news reporter. Just put him in the back of my station wagon, boy. Everything shut down. There's nobody around. <laughs> they, don't even, they don't even have an ambulance. Just put him in the back of the station wagon. We'll get him there. <laughs> you work with what you got. They put a giant stretcher for just the little kids. They could have just put him in the car seat. <laughs> uh... <laughs> All right, I want to get this body over to the corner right away. Oh, the the coroner or the corner? <laughs> they just dump it off in the corner. That's it. 
Quill, you know something's going on around here. I mean, look around you. The town's almost empty. I mean, it must have something to do with that girl. You said no, Ma. Look, I got my job to do, and you got your job. I think the town's always been this empty. Yeah. Just one night. I mean, then I can analyze. The two are looking out of the background, like, what the? A murder happens in town. How many people are showing up compared to this? Why don't you go out on a limb for once in your life? I'm cutting my hair. That's a limb. I've been out on a limb. You old people don't know that. All right. You got one night. But first thing tomorrow morning, I want you to get that body to the corner. Now you got me. What's she gonna do with it? That's the doctor, coming. right? That's the doctor lady? Yeah. yeah. Okay, just double check. That's, no, it wasn't. It's the doctor lady doctor. <laughs> doctor lady, <laughs> ma'am. <laughs> uh, oh, we referenced that. It's, it's a thing now. I can't remember. What lady, that. doctor. Well, that was from a... Uh, Space Mutiny. Yes, thank you. Thank lady, you. doctor. <laughs> Bastard. I forgot who was in the chat that kept, like... Like cussing, like doing. It might have been Steve, but it also could have been uh, Luke, who was like, "Lock your doctor, lady, bitch, <laughs> whore." <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, the oh, 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 no. this new Halloween H two O looks good. Look, I'm sorry, I didn't think it was safe yet. <laughs> she didn't notice her in the back yeah, seat. Yeah, they couldn't see that giant mullet in the back seat. Oh, lady. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Are you okay? Doctor, lady, or bitch, come rag. <laughs> Mr. Mitchell, Dr. Trey. Mitchell, look, look at that little grill. Wait, is this the old lady's house? That's a big porch to be able to afford a small grill like that. Agreed. That's a huge one. God, you know it's like they're stuck in the '70s and it has green carpet. <laughs> Green and brown was like the two colors of the 70s. That's literally all you can see in this picture other than his blue jeans. But, to be fair, it's the 80s, but it's bigger the country is a couple oh, decades. The country is... Oh, they got another special K, you oh, son of yep, a bitch. Yep. It's their only food in the whole house. Grains. Oh, I guess, yeah, I forgot this is supposed to be a zombie movie. <laughs> in a way. In it's a in a way. compilation of zombie movies. I don't expect much. This is like going to be like that scene from Signs when Mel Gibson puts the knife underneath the table. No. Or underneath the door. It even sounds like the music from Signs. You know it's country if they got jarred fruits and vegetables. It's a lot of garlic. Yeah. You, so we know it's a zombie movie, not a vampire movie. Eh, you never know. Potato chips? That looks like Maybe it's a zombie vampires. You see that butt plug on the right? The cone? Yeah, he prepared I'm convinced their pantry is bigger than their bedrooms. It's even the <laughs> it's even the pantry is shag carpeted. Oh, oh! Oh! He got into the vegetables. You got any gizzards? the ham it's Easter Sunday I know he's not dead because he didn't shit himself the same when you die you shit yourself might be Florida. There's a there's a Goodland. Oh, this is <laughs> our, this is Missouri. Oh, great! Here we go. Let's hit the sauce. Say <laughs> eighties. Everybody was on the sauce. This could be Missouri because I look up Goodland. And that's what his door says. There's Goodland, Kansas, Indiana, Florida, and Missouri. Missouri. 
Oh shit. Tom, I'm actually I'm I'm caught up on it. Oh man. Oh that's depressing. Um I'm caught up on it. I've been playing Final Fantasy Nine, so I've been watching that in the background. Well I'm going through I'm on disc three, so I'm going through the cho- uh, the Chocobo Hot and Cold. So you know how that is. So while I'm playing that I've been watching I'm caught up on the Final Fantasy Seven streams and it's hilarious. Yeah, the Shinra. Who's this guy? I don't know. But I suspect he's about to die. Or she's gonna die. <laughs> he poured, Tom said, who, who died? He poured one, one out for his homies. <laughs> <laughs> he, poured, he poured more than one. That's I don't know who that guy was. He just found him in a food pantry. Damn near a third of a bottle. That's where I want to die, is the food pantry full of food. <laughs> uh, it depends on how I die in the food pantry. <laughs> It does. It really does. Did I die from the food or did I get shot? Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking for your pills. <laughs> if you didn't know any better, these two were her sisters and the one's going through a sex change. <laughs> what? <laughs> if you didn't know any better, these two were sisters and one of them's going through a sex change. <laughs> Campbell's chicken noodle. Poss- <laughs> possibility. <laughs> oh god. Oh wait, the system will turn off soon. Oh. I'm sorry. I've been uh, watching movie. I'm a guy. I'm a girl. I'm scared. I'm really scared. I'm 5'14. Oh Kyle, can you hit me with a little bit of that? Oh, sure. A little bit. Here. Tracy Mitchell was a beautiful girl. I'll tell you when. Every Monday morning, she put a rose on my desk. And there. Thank you. Mm-hmm. No. <sighs> Oh god, the soap opera part. Here we go. Yeah, the you know, at least papers. this is a small portion of the movie. Like, Captain America was this oh, for god. an hour. And a half. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much the entire fucking movie. God, Captain America was terrible. Just with the bike scene? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. A really long bike a scene. A bike scene and a guy getting suffocated by a muffler to a truck? <laughs> god. <laughs> I blocked that out. Uh, <laughs> he literally just takes the muffler of that semi and just puts it into it the trailer. Very anti Captain America. It was and then I was like, "This can't be the ending of it." It was the ending of it. Well, no, I said I was like, and I was like, "Watch, he doesn't even get credit." The cops show up, and he, uh, soon enough, you're wee woo. I'm like, "Son of a bitch!" <laughs> <laughs> like, look, it, was, it was a Magnum PI episode. Yeah, it really. It was a drugged. Uh, like, yeah. yeah, like if it had like a season finale that was three episodes long yeah. or some shit. But see, yeah, but Magnum PI is actually good. Yeah, Captain or, America. Or, or like Rockford Files, or so, you Something. know, like like a eight, like a late seventies, early eighties, like crime show. Yeah. Where's the mutant? Like, I keep. Uh... We just watched a black kid die. <laughs> let's, yeah, let's have that a, was a green kid from. What let's I have thought. a romantic. She was dead for a while. So I'm on the run from the law. You might lose. You just lost a kid. Uh, no, I don't know what happened to my friend. I got beat up at a bar. My brother's dead. Let's bump. Oh, that is his brother. Yeah. Oh, he's having constipation. Wait, what happened? Oh, wait, hold it, hold it. So how did he get? And then Uncle Jim. <laughs> wait, a girl? Wait, hold it. He's easy, easy, Josh. Take it easy. Where am I? You've been unconscious for a while. Why am I naked? <laughs> You've been unconscious for a while. <laughs> what happened? When you found that girl, did you touch her? <laughs> well, how do you mean? Um, yeah. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got you under pedophile charges, but thank God this is Missouri, so <laughs> it's a uh, just your first time is a warning. <laughs> <laughs> Toxic chemical reaction. 
chemical reaction. Wait a second, how, how can I get a chemical reaction from a little girl? I don't know, but I'm sure you'll be all right in the morning. You lost that double dutch. That's how you lost. <laughs> Has Mike showed up? No, not yet. Listen, I, I gotta get out of here. I gotta find him. Listen, you're not gonna be able to look for him tonight because I gave you a shot and you're just gonna have to rest. A shot of what? Whiskey? If there are any problems, we'll give you a call. Uh oh, it's Dr. Bitch, Horror Cunt. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Lady, Dr. <laughs> lady. She's the, and she was just talking about earlier in the movie, she's like, you're just mad because I'm the only female doctor in the fucking South. Alright, all two cops for the state of Georgia. Two different cars, too. You notice his antenna's on the left and the other car, the antenna's in the middle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had the gumball machine on top, too. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's got the little round part, yeah. yeah. Oh! Oh! He's like, he's on a wild turkey, he must be dead. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he touched his arm, so he's probably getting infected. It won't work, Captain. Every light bulb in the house is missing. The body's missing. How'd you miss the body? Now, he was right here. How'd you miss him? I guess he just got walked out. Walked away. Walked out. Yep. What do you think? You think how did he let him go? It's not like he passed out or anything. He didn't drink enough. He, yeah, he, 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 yeah, had, he, one, he had one solid and shot. That, he poured the rest Well, out. him seeing the bottle doesn't yeah, help. Yeah. Agreed, agreed. Let me tell you something, Tom. I got a dead child over at Myler's right now. And I'm telling you. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That body's in Myra Tate's. What happened to the coroner? Well, I was going to send it over in the morning. Well, you don't make those decisions. I do. And I told you to send that body today. And what is it Myra Tate's for anyway? She's just a, a GP, not a pathologist. She might be a GP, but she knows enough. Yeah, just like you, huh? You know, I'm sick of... What's a GP? <laughs> a general practitioner? <laughs> I don't... Could be, yeah. Well, I'm having you suspend me. Well, then you better suspend me, because I'm telling you there's something going on here. You know, Somebody gets your black ass. This job was a handout to you anyway. Everybody felt sorry for you. Everyone knows why you don't like wearing that gun. He was probably dead drunk when you shot that kid. They gave him a whistle. Ooh. A southern black cop? That's what we're saying. He's already dead. That's what we're saying! <laughs> I think this belongs to you. He caught it, so he can't be that drunk. Agreed. That's where, we're, like, Steve, if you see, like, uh, they're, like, in the bar found that the teacher works at. I don't know how the fuck that works. Because, you know, the town is so short-handed that, no. uh... Prevent travel. It was filled with Confederate flags. Is that Dramamine? Is that a promotional thing? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Prevent travel, Dramamine. It, it prevent fucking, travel sickness. Dramamine. It, no, it sabotages airplanes. <laughs> he loves the body to withstand the shock. Or look, there's even a poster in the hallway. Like, the, it's it's got to be like a Pepsi advertising. Like, yeah, this is our uh, one of our supporters. Yeah. Feels like I'm coming. It's the cure to the movie, like all the zombies. <laughs> like, jam me, <laughs> help jam me. me. <laughs> oh, that'd be funny as shit. I think, and this is a guess here, that this chemical... Yeah, go sit over there and look at the eye chart. Tell me what letters you see. It expands rapidly when mixed with blood. Growing in volume many times. Wait, what the? When did he oh, get infected? Yeah, I said go look at the letter chart, not have a brain aneurysm. What's up? Yeah, his head. Yeah. Poor creature. Oh, she put a vagina on her hand. What's up? With, okay, everyone's hands He's going nutty like, professor. I do like the lighting, though. It but, gives it that nice... Hey, you notice all the victims with the slits in their hands? Yeah, what's up with that? Yeah. Oh, I guess we're about to find out. <laughs> the, the give vaginas. I do like the lighting on him. Whatever. Still baffles me. This is like, how did he get infected? It, even though this is the eighties, it's given it the most like sixties like zombie Assuming look to him. Don't pay any attention to them. Yeah. Oh god. And blood I'm sweating out my ear. There's no telling how far. We call this Montezuma's revenge. Any more of these creatures? Explosive diarrhea. Hatred for women being in the workplace. <laughs> oh boy. It's your fight on, lady. What the hell? 
<laughs> Robin Williams wants your booty. Apparently. Oh. Okay, uh, there's an ex explanation for the slits in the hands. Oh, the orange oozy shit, too. That's like, uh, what's, that's a, what, what, what am Phantasm? I Phantasm? Yes! Yeah, yeah. Austin? Yeah. You serve some when, he get, when he gets his fingers cut off? Yeah. Yeah. The cheese sauce? <laughs> yeah. Like the piss <laughs> color like, nacho cheese. You know yeah. cheese was the Yeah. Bag. It's the only, it's the only body fluid. It's, that, that's the only color I can think in a movie that it was that. What am I trying to say? It's the only body fluid in a movie that was that color that mm. I could think of. Yeah. It's just like a yellow orangey, like it's a sunny D whiz. color. Like, yeah. Like, yeah, it's like sunny D or cheese whiz. Okay, so wait, so they're like mutants with radioactive just, slits. Yeah, so how did he get infected? He just touched. Oh, now she's screwed. Yeah. Oh, that makes sense because earlier they were grabbing people by the throat and it was just steaming. Uh huh, uh huh. So the. So if the whole town... Is, oh, yeah, the car. I forgot about that. Now you know he hasn't been here. Now what? Oh, now it's daytime. She grew like a shit ton of hair. And ever since I arrived in this damn town, it's been nothing but insanity. I got rednecks trying to kill me. Yep. That little girl falls on me, and the doctor... Yep. Me I got a chemical reaction. I, Dude, you haven't even included the bar fight you got involved with. Gosh. Wait a second. There's a chemical plant here, isn't there? No. No. Maybe that's what's keeping them fucking hatred. There is new era. It's this big conglomerate. They're supposed to reactivate the old mines. I hear they're into oil, coal, chemicals. Yes. You know where it is? Sure. Yes. This is where the property starts. Right here. What's her bumper sticker saying? Why is it in the front? No <laughs> trespassing. Well, I guess we better turn around. <laughs> <laughs> the end. I was like, hey, we're going back to there. All right, how are we going to get in here? I hear they shoot first and ask questions later. Listen, uh, first of all, we are not going to go in there. Second of all, not because you're a woman, all right? But if I get spotted, I can run a lot faster. No, listen, Holly, just give me 15 minutes. 15 minutes, I'll be right back. You think he's really gonna take 15 minutes? No. I don't think so either. He's right. gonna be dead by man, boy. Yep. Yeah, just make yourself enough attention. What the hell? Wait, so this is a big conglomerate? So this is the chemical plant, right? Yeah, like, that just has a chain link fence. It no looks like a no way of entry. <laughs> Doesn't look like much of a plant. Hey, that's the that's the car that almost ran him over. It looks like a scene from uh, Tremors. Yeah. Oh, the padlock, not locked. Guess they weren't expecting trespassers. Why don't you just open the gate? Dude, who, who honestly would think of this? Well, that's your average redneck, I'll tell you what. <laughs> Somebody's like, hey, who's that guy hanging up there? Is that you, Mike? <laughs> Be like Friday the 13th, part three. Oh, now we have like a toxic Avenger vibe. A little bit, but in the country, put that shit stain on his back. I ask questions. I'm not asking it, I'm addressing oh. it. Oh, watch that third step, it's a bitch. <laughs> yeah, it is. Man. At least they go off. At least they follow OSHA. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Lots of PPE. Look, it's the Cooter Farm. Oh, 
Oh, look, good thing he fell on that one second. Oh, you're a dead man. <laughs> How they didn't see him. <laughs> hey! I told you. I was gonna. Well, I was gonna say the car that was outside looked like his. We're making moonshine. <laughs> I posted it on Facebook two minutes ago. <laughs> oh, <laughs> just boy. fucking, just fucking, uh, Dukes of Hazard your way in there. <laughs> They were like, fuck this job, I'm dead. Yeah, I get. Oh, oh no! Oh. Someone's about to get hosed with that shit. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh right yeah. in the dick. <laughs> no. Oh, what the? How many people? She are put fall mustard in there? everywhere, dude. <laughs> oh god, it's like cheap, like McDonald's mustard. I never, <laughs> I never watched it to hazards, but I imagine this was just like an episode. Pretty much. I need to edit in. I need to edit in the uh, the horn. <laughs> Just draw it over Jimmy Carter's face. Oh, that's not helping you at all, buddy. Because he pours out a whole bite. I don't drink no more drinks, buddy. Yeah, no more grab me a fit. Bitch, you're double parking. Steve, Tom, how are you guys doing today? Hopefully you're enjoying this, whatever the fuck this movie is. I'm pretty sure it's over with. It pretty much ended two minutes ago. You tell Bill not to drink the water, Jesus. Yeah, seriously. We're dumping all the chemicals into the mines. Yeah, I have a feeling it's going to end like cabin fever. You find out it's in the water supply. Actually, do you ever watch, was it the creep, was it, oh God, what's it called, the creeps? No. What's the name of that? Fuck it. It was almost a, it was like a zombie movie, but it wasn't. The Slither? No, not Slither. I was saying, not the Creeps. I gotta figure this out. It was a good movie. Cooties? No. No, Cooties, that, I need to see that. Yeah, with the uh, fucking, uh, oh god. Elijah Wood. Yep. And, yep. uh, yeah, the place Dwight Schrute. So, uh, Rain Wilson. Oh, wait, the Crazies is what I'm thinking of. Oh, yeah, that movie's great, dude. Yeah, like, the original and the and the remake. Yeah. I showed you the comics I have. There, no. There's uh, a couple comic book issues that were kind of prequels to the remake. So they kind of show the, the, the main people that got infected mm. throughout the town, like the guy that walks on the baseball diamond with the shotgun, the, the rednecks and all that with yeah. the guns. Um, it, each issue is like a prequel to show how they got infected. It's, it's pretty good. Oh man! Oh, oh God! The Grandpa Monster is mad. That does look like the dad from the Monsters. How did he get it, but she didn't? I don't know. Violet, your turn to Violet. Violet. Pissing out his hand too. Imagine if you pissed at your hand. What the hell? Could you, like, imagine if you just was like peed everywhere with your hand. But open. with cheese whiz. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. So why do they take light bulbs out? Why do they hate the lights? I guess they're uh, gremlins or uh, mungwise. 
The, but, bright light! Oh, nice, nice reference. I like that. Bright light! <laughs> <laughs> Clearly not, lady. <laughs> it's blue, oh god, it's a Republic. <laughs> Got here really quick. It took her sweet ass time getting out of the car. She said Bojack. Something. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's what you get for drinking on the job. Uh. <laughs> oh, right, right. There. He had no regrets. He's he like, bam, 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 bam. <laughs> What the? Oh, wait. He's wait. Like, we. <laughs> wait, so what's up with the light bulbs? Or are we about to find out? It's electricity? He yell, Dude, you know what his yell sounds like? Like, like the Nazi zombies in Call of Duty. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> I was not a huge fan of that crap, but I gotta be honest with you. Yeah. You're right. He's got two calendars. He's got a calendar there and another one on the left side if you look at the other shot. I mean, we might be the only three people left. Well, that oh, one or not. suck. Well, whatever we do, we better do it before nightfall. Seems the light hurts their eyes. All right. Uh, yep, there's a calendar right there behind me. Can really see me? He's got 38 specials. So we'll go by Myra's, pick up the body, and I'll personally dump it in Dawson's lap. Let's go. No, no, you go. I still gotta find my... Room. We're gonna shoot ourselves some villagers. <laughs> no shit. Some townspeople. I haven't seen him since... Uh, yeah, to what this town needs is a good old-fashioned mob. <laughs> uh, good old lynch. Yeah. Lynching? Good, yeah. Some no, good old and pitchforks and torches. Everybody get your local... Get your local pitchforks from the... Uh, Home Depot. Hmm? Get your... Get your, uh... Oh, no, I'm good. Thank you, though. Oh, my gosh. It burns. <laughs> a little bit? Little bit? Let's say like I've had like Jack and Jim, but it's never been like, whoo, man, I gotta take a second before the next one. <laughs> <laughs> like, like Makers. Makers is so far the strongest I think I've ever sipped up. That's only like 90 proof. Oh, it's only 90 proof. Yeah, it's only 90 proof. Well, let me check what Tito's is. I'm gonna guess 80. You can do it, us. I believe in you. Myra? Oh, something's about to happen. Myra. <laughs> Mine's bigger. <laughs> <laughs> All I needed was like a half gallon. Don't make me go home and bring home my. I pull out. I pull out the fucking half gallon. And be like, my no. bigger. <laughs> um, eighty proof. Ah, come on. No, that's that's I, just I, not bad. No, that's like eighty proof. Is a nice sweet spot. And uh, what's your percent alcohol volume? Probably 30, 40. Well, uh, the percent is 45. 45. Ooh, you're can, only five more. It's always, it's always, uh, double the percent is the proof. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so, like, 40 percent is always 80. Oh, proof. right. So, if I have 40, the proof is 80. Yep. The, okay, if you have 45, makes, the proof is 90. That makes sense. Yep. Yep. Did you want to try some? I know you're not a vodka person. If you have a glass, Oops. I'll have it. I'll, I'll, there? I'll try it. It's it. Usually vodka's it does not agree well with me. Oh, that's whiskey, so. <laughs> um, I'll let you serve yourself. Oh, oh okay, yeah, that'll be okay. Yeah. It's been many moons since I've tried uh, vodka, so. But it's like, you know, it's like, well, switch from that to that, that should taste like water. <laughs> with, <laughs> with the way your makers has been... Like I said, this Tito, like I mean, with Tito's, is really good, Tito's, so. the first sip is like, you know, it's got that first burn, and then after a while, it's like water. Ironically, Austin, Texas. Yeah. Gee. Tito. <laughs> Tito Jackson. <laughs> All right. Anyways, movie time. Oh, there he goes, back in the same spot where he was. Oh, it's because I'm too hammered or what, but... Does it smell? Honestly, if I didn't do it, I'd rather smell water. Uh, feel free. Oh, shit, they shot him. Oh, that's dangerous. 
Yeah. That's so smooth. <laughs> yeah, I told you. <laughs> like, when you go from Baker's to that, it, like I said, God. when you, if you had just this, you know, you kind of feel that first burn. You're like, mm -hmm. ooh, yeah, that's liquor. And then you're like, okay, that's pretty smooth. And just keep going, keep going. If, if you were to keep drinking and not stop, it's like nothing. But yeah, if you were to yeah. take a little sip here, you're like, okay. A little sip there, like, ooh, okay. <laughs> but, like... Yeah, no, like, that's actually... Yeah, when you had that with the... Oh, God. Where did all the people show up from? But when you have that with the mixed drink, you don't even taste it. Actually, that's something I need to buy is a chud. Ch oh, I don't know why the, I only thought of that, but I did. The first one or the second one? First one? i never seen the first one, but the second one is... The second one is ridiculous. The first one's more of a serious movie. It has John Goodman. It has really Does it really? Only for like 30 seconds. Okay, but still. But no, like the, the first one was like a genuine horror movie. The second one's more of a comedy. The second one, Bruno and I streamed, and it was like, what the fuck? Yeah, it, it really like I would. But the chud. The first one's actually pretty good. And what cracks me up about the second one is that I've seen Child's Play two all the time. So the dad playing uh, Bud the Chud is like the funniest fucking thing I've seen. <laughs> Dude. Chud is an expensive movie, Jesus. Yeah. $44? <laughs> she locked him in the basement? What a bitch. Dude, that sweat stain in his back keeps getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> 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 like, watch it on this streak. <laughs> like, watch how big his, pit, his, his pit and his back Oh, dude, no, like, it was earlier. It was, like, Yeah, earlier, so. <laughs> yeah no, like, actually, it's gone now, Jesus. Oh. Yeah, like... <laughs> Fucking big it is. And now it's enormous. <laughs> it's a continent. The first show was a horror movie. Uh, and that's what I've heard. I've heard the first one was like... Yeah. Like... Like if the first Terminator was a horror film and the second one was an action movie, I'd imagine that's how... The show movie was. Uh, oh! There he is. Shot. He got a shot through the heart. Okay, you, Tom and Steve, you guys seen Porky's, right? Does this guy this guy is not the same actor, but does he not look like Pee Wee from Porky's, or uh, the dad from uh, the Mr. Bean movie from the nineties? I'm way to bring this up while his friend died. He 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 died and they laid his body on a uh, on a. Uh, What's the thing that you... The bed that you set up between two trees? Hammock. Hammock, yes. Oh, oh shit. Oh! Oh! Shit's going down. No. Who the hell... Where the hell did she come from? Oh, A Little Piece of Heaven? Oh, my God. Kyle, have you heard of that movie? No. Little Piece of Heaven with uh, Kirk Cameron? Oh, my God. That movie... Okay, I'm going I'm to explain the synapses to you, and I want you to look at me as seriously as possible. Kirk Cameron okay. plays a movie. He lives in a country, in a farm. His sister is mentally challenged. Doesn't have anybody to play with. Kirk Cameron goes to an orphanage dressed as Jesus to convince a kid that they're dead so that his mentally challenged sister has a friend to play with. <laughs> I couldn't even explain it to you. How fucking hell is that? <laughs> the, and the worst part is, more kids get involved, and more kids start to be aware, while the police start to investigate, and he kidnaps the kids and they go off somewhere. And the worst part about it, by the end of the movie, he gets away scot-free. <laughs> That's a really creepy movie. Oh. Uh, the premise is creepy. The movie is filmed like it's a kid's movie. Jesus Christ. Come back, Billy. Yeah, don't, don't break the Tito. No, I don't. She's going back to school. My understanding, all the, all the kids just don't go to school. No, hardly any of them. Just at the all. teacher after she leaves the bar. Oh, God. It's Miss Pierce. Um, Steve, there's a there's a YouTuber I watch called Cinema Snob, and he went over that movie, and goddamn, that movie was something else. 
Ugh. I hope so. Where's Bruno with the sexual jokes? By now? Right? No shit. This is yeah. What I'm missing out on right now. Like you, like you said, like the, the cardboard cutout of his uh, pre-recorded phrases. Do the macarena. <laughs> Billy, go away, go away. Oh God. I'm jerking it. Go away. <laughs> oh. Oh. He's, he's like. Yeah. He's, yep, he's a thing. <laughs> Don't touch Don't him. Don't touch his hand. Don't do it. Oh, you burn. dumb bitch. No, no burn. Oh, he's normal. God damn it. I'm for now. Him. For now. Burn. I'm disappointed. I thought you were just in my dreams. Yeah, my dream. Is there some kind of a love scene between these two I don't want it. that no, I missed? Don't, 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 no. <laughs> Did I miss a deleted no. scene? Scared. Is he Scared. dead too? Barnes and Noble has this. What? Chud, sorry. Oh, I thought you meant this movie. I'm really trying to find Chud right now. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle's out there looking for a Chud. Oh, man. Okay, let's go. What the hell was that scene? Kyle, what is that? What? Where? Did you what? see that? Okay, watch on the uh, screen. I'm oh, looking, God. I'm looking. Oh, you're stuck. Well, they might what, show it. What, what's on the well, screen? Yeah, go in the bathroom stall. They, they won't get you there. <laughs> Okay, I'm trying to look at the... Oh, uh, yeah, the screen. You'll see it. It's... Oh, so there's urinals. Yeah. And then next to it, there's this big old, like, that thing. Is that a tub? Is that a sink? I, I think it's a huge sink for washing hands. Yeah, it reminds me if you ever see those yeah. videos of, like, somewhere in Ireland or, like, England. There's those giant urinals that just you just piss on the floor. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. It's just literally a pool that goes all the way down. It's, it's a, a giant urinal. Yeah. It's a trough. Those yeah. Those concerts and shit. Yeah. And oh! Th Holy shit. The kid got fucked. Just ripped that kid apart. Lady, you risked your life for this kid <laughs> twice, so you had what you had coming. And this guy doesn't even own a gun, and he's in the south, so you tell me where he fucked up. All of a sudden, these kids just all showed up. Kyle, all these kids are zombies. Agreed. Okay, when the fuck did they go to school? Don't ask questions. Don't <laughs> they ask weren't questions. even here earlier. How is everyone, is it the groundwater that's getting everyone infected? They've been drinking out of the trough, the piss trough again. This is how baby boomers seen uh, the grunge era. <laughs> All these kids were just pieces of shit. You know, you may be a zombie. That doesn't mean you don't have the common sense to walk back to where they are. <laughs> yeah, eat our piss out of our hands. Why did they go to school in the first... I don't know. Don't ask questions. You keep asking questions. Yeah. And, and, well, the thing is, too, is that I'll rewatch these streams sober, and I'll be like, you dumbass, this is why. But sometimes they don't really get answered. Man, I wonder who's going to... Whose mom's going to pick up all those kids from school? Yeah. The school... A, a zombie bus driver shows say? up. All right, get out. Dark times. Okay. You oh, I thought he was. I said. Yeah, you knew what I was thinking. <laughs> he just, she, he just grabs her by the head, <laughs> throws her <laughs> over to his side. You knew what I was thinking. <laughs> yeah, yell at her. That'll calm her down. Yelling calms her. Yelling her down. right in her ear. That'll calm yeah. her down. Calm down. That's no, a feel no. at home. <laughs> Sorry, it doesn't work like that ever. It know. does in the south. <laughs> Some things work in the south that shouldn't work in the south. I'm yeah. Just saying. Surprisingly, right. the only cop still alive is the black one. <laughs> oh, you tell me how the fuck that. Did the white I think, one die? I I don't know. I think he died. I got this movie. He said, "Hold on, I gotta go step and get some smokes." <laughs> <laughs> get some smokes and some rubbers. Hold <laughs> <on>. <laughs> He's like, "If we make it out of here, I don't want to have a baby." <laughs> uh oh. Uh, the fog's gonna get her. I would at least duck down and wait. This is actually kind of creepy. Oh, no shit. She's like, looked at the camera, well, I'm fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the sheriff did bite it. What about the black, the black cop? The black cop. 
Call of Duty Black Cops. <laughs> oh! I like that. You got Officer Winslow. <laughs> <laughs> you got the new, uh, the new Black Cops. Oh, God. There's the scrubbing bush they use in the showers. Grab the shovel. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, Bag light and a revolver can't go wrong. Yeah, I know. It was probably what, an old 38? 30, 30. Were those even spent casings? Did it, I don't know. He just, un- he just unloaded it and threw it on the ground. He's like, I got to use this. That's a doctor, lady, bitch. Doctor, lady, doctor. I can't say doctor without saying that now. <laughs> it's like an instinct. Doctor, lady, bitch. That's your next physical. I love you. Like, that's what it said on her desk. It was like, you know, her title was on the desk, and it said doctor, lady, bitch. Ugh. At least duck chick, so no one sees you. Oh, my God. Oh, God, she found herself in a Michael Jackson. Oh, look, it burned through the glass. Yeah. That's she found fun. herself in a Michael Jackson music video. <laughs> that was a good effect, though, I'll say that. That's pretty good, yeah, no, I've never yeah, seen that before. In all movie. seriousness, like, I'll, I'll give them credit for that. They actually look less like zombies and more like the people in uh, Dead Presidents. They look more like emos. Yeah. You ever seen the movie Dead Presidents? No. Well, I'll show you about what you're about to look at. It's a 90s movie. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, that's what <laughs> that's what they look like, Kyle. <laughs> You're not wrong. You're not they, wrong. They, uh, they rob a bank or whatever. Of course. And that's the makeup that they put on. Oh, God. What was... Uh, Steve or Tom, it's a Simpsons joke. Isn't there a Simpsons episode or something? Which one? Uh, where Chief Wiggum is chilling in the radio. The Juggalos are trying to kill the girl. Yeah. <laughs> uh, wasn't there one where Chief Wiggum is just hanging out in his car, and then there's a radio broadcast where there's like, yep, the mist is rolling in. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. I think it's I think it's the one with Bleeding Gums Murphy. Oh god, there's a junkie on the roof. I really do like that effect they have. With yeah, it's pretty glass. cool. It actually is very good. I right mean, it there. is a chemical reaction. These aren't voodoo zombies or yeah. virus zombies. These no, are actually it's chemical it's zombies. Actually respectable. Yeah, these are... Oh god, he broke into the... Bo- <laughs> what, <laughs> what the, the fuck? fuck was that? This is not too bad. Kyle, this no, is like, not a bad... You know, like, it's when shit's getting real, I mean, it's slow the first half. Honestly, when they showed up to the chemical place and blew it the fuck up, I thought that's when the movie was going to be over. Yeah, like, no, like... Oh, just randomly catch on fire tires. I've seen far worse. Which isn't saying much for us because we watch Idaho Transfer. But right, but still, Captain this is America. a lot more action than the Captain America movie. No shit. This is way better than Captain America. Way better. It could have been a Treehouse of Horror episode. <laughs> like, this really isn't terrible. Like, honestly, this is pretty good. Yeah. Then again, we're not sober. I mean, what, yeah, yeah, go to the Quaker State. Apparently, there was a restaurant in Grand Rapids that was called Quaker State, and it wasn't an oil place. It was like a burger shop or something. And it was uh, pretty good. I'll be telling you, right now for me, this is a this is a B movie, like B rank. It, in seriousness, it's about a B minus to me. Like, like this is. I forgot about ranking. Yeah, like this is. This, this really isn't... And silliness? It's not that... No. Like, that's, not, that's what can't... Like, it Did we me... what? Did we find a decent movie in the shit pile? This might be it. Did we found a decent movie? Like, like I mean, don't wrong. Like, it's not phenomenal. It's not phenomenal. Yeah, but, but like... garbage. But if you were to show me this as a kid and I watched, like, zombie movies, I would probably enjoy this. No, I mean, I'm, I'm, right now, uh, in all seriousness, I mean, granted, I'm not yeah. sober, but, like, I'm entertained. Yeah. This isn't bad. I'm not terribly bored. I mean, like I said, the first twenty minutes, it's kind of like, "What is this?" Oh yeah, no. But when it is. when when the zombies actually start happening, this is not too bad. Like like so, right now, like I'll tell you what, it's more interesting than uh, Night of the Zombies. I'm trying to the remember. one with the tribal woman, the one that oh I'm, god, yeah. that movie was terrible. I mean, it had god. its goofy moments, but I could never sit through that again. No, no. Like this, I mean, honestly, the acting isn't terrible. 
Uh, the, the special effects, like, it's, it's low-budget special effects, obviously, but still, considering this is a low-budget movie... As a horror fan, yeah. It's... Like, I, I, can, I can totally respect the whole zombies melting through the glass thing. That was good. I like it. Ah, uh, yes, the cliche of the Molotov. <laughs> Never good for the undead folks. Yeah, Don't do right. it. I'm surprised one wasn't already made. <laughs> 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 I mean, it's fucking Missouri in the 80s, so... <laughs> you understand me? Kind of don't have a field goal. He kind of tipped it into a, a a a street with no other cars. So. Okay. Okay. Plus, your other one's in a ditch. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. He's like, drink up. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. It's He's like, bitch, you act like you never made a ball time before. You're a bartender and a teacher, so. <laughs> True that. True that. <laughs> I'll Actually, I, I take it back. No, the, the, the Molotov idea with this is good because they don't like the light. Oh, I never realized that. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I so forgot. It, it's kind of like uh, the, the original Night of the Living Dead. Yeah. And that, the zombies don't like light. Yeah. So, no. you know and what? The, yeah, the okay. remake kind of did that, but they didn't follow through with it. Like, you know, Ben shows the torch or whatever, and they're like, ugh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um... Uh, technically... Actually, technically, I would see this more as... Uh, the Last Man on Earth, or like I Am Legend, because oh. remember I Am Legend, they didn't like light. They only they showed really, up. Yeah. They only showed up at night time. Like, it's kind of like a, yeah, no, no, like and they they just they, they destroy the light source that uh, Charlton Heston had. The generator. Yeah, like they ended up shooting out one of the lights, and then that's when they invade. Yeah. That's another movie my mom will watch a hundred times. Honestly, there, Omega Man, Rosemary's Baby, The Thing, Race with the Devil, and... Yeah, I guess Invasion of the Bible. Honestly, Omega Man, I haven't seen a lot, but that, that really was a good movie. Yeah. Like, it really yeah. was. Like, we need some more bottles. Right? Would be. Who could Go it back be? And, come out <laughs> and get some more bottles. Please? It's kind of dragging the scene out, though. A little bit, yeah. Like, okay, you're, you're, you're making Molotov. We get it. And you're you know what's a movie I think I need to rewatch is Planet Terror. I can't remember Planet I, I, the, the girl has the M16 for a leg. Honestly, I've never watched it. Um, I watched it when I was a kid. And, well, when it came out. It was like 2008, 2007. Like, everyone says it's amazing. I've never heard anyone say anything hey, bad um, about I it, liked but... it as a kid. I need to give it a rewatch is the thing. They never explain how you're able to shoot an M16 with it attached to your leg, but I'll take it for what it is. It's kind of like Hobo the Shotgun. <laughs> yeah. It's a grindhouse movie. Yeah, it's exactly what it is. Uh, Bruce Will I think Tarantino is like the producer for it. But uh, Bruce Willis is the bad guy, and he castrates a lot of people. Uh -oh. And I remember at the end of it, he's... Speaking of a hobo and a oh shotgun. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. That asshole's alive. Oh, no! I didn't think about it. Shit. Dennis Quaid is back. Rosemary's baby, yeah, it is. Things run around. Come here. Oh, help her. Thank God it's only you. Rose McGowan has a gun, like, yeah. You're not going to be quite so happy when you hear what I got in mind. Yeah. Oh, Bruce Willis God. is the bad guy in that movie, and I, if I remember correctly, he turns into a giant fucking tentacle mutant at the end. <laughs> oh, Planet Terror. Really? Yeah. Oh, and I kind of want to and, and, yeah, I mean, the hot chick has an M16 and a grenade launcher for a lake. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, you're deaf right after that. Yeah. yeah. No, he's even got he's even got buck shots in there. I mean, look at the the spread it did on the fucking wall. Oh, he's even got an RC fridge for his Jesus, RC hat. Jesus, RC Cola clearly funded most of this movie. Yeah. That and Dramamine. All I did was stab you in the arm. Sponsored. Why is it? God, words are so hard. Jesus. Get the rope. Get Just shoot him. Get it over with. Really? You know he's a piece of crap. Come on, turn around! Put your hands behind your back. You know, Steve, now that I remember that movie... Oh, shit. You shoot. And you kill this little gal. Shoot, I get the moon! Now that I remember that movie, Steve, doesn't the mom, like the nurse, her son gets babysit by babysitters and her son ends up dying or some shit? Like... Wasn't that pretty, like, a dark scene or something with that? There's another RC cult the fucking side. Oh, he's dead. 
Dude, he almost looked like Bruce Campbell in that shot. Like, <laughs> like, like, watch it on this. He almost looks like a knockoff Bruce Campbell. Don't insult Bruce Campbell like that. I know, right? God, I won't, now I need to watch that. Like a young Jesus. Bruce Campbell, I should say. I need to watch those movies. Watch Evil Dead tomorrow. That'll be my, my AM routine. Coffee and Evil Dead. <laughs> a little bit. That sounds like a bio. That sounds like a biography. Coffee and Evil Dead, <laughs> or like a podcast or something. Uh, oh yeah, no, definitely a podcast. Yeah, this is okay. This is very Night of the Living Dead right now. Mm-hmm. Yep. And Mr. Cooper's throwing the the Molotovs mm-hmm. out the upper window. Yeah, I thought so. I was like, man, that was a really dark scene from what I remember from that movie. What are you talking about? Oh, uh, Planet Terror. Oh, yeah. I've seen that movie once, but I remember quite a bit of it. I probably need to watch that. It's one of those movies that was big when it came out, and then it just easily just sizzled out. If we please you... What's that sound say? If we please you... I can't tell. Yeah, these people are not going to make it. I, I already feel it. This is not going to be a happy ending. I mean, it's not bad. I'm... Yeah, I, I do like me a good zombie flick. I find oh, out hell yeah. the They're movies I rewatch the most happen to be zombie movies. This guy's been touched five times by now, and, and now once has he turned into a zombie. Yeah, he's going behind the counter. He's fucking. These. This is what's going to be like when quarantine's back open. Everybody needs their oil change. <laughs> <laughs> like, get back! No, this is bottle return day. Yeah, this is bottle return. <laughs> we need our bottles. Stay back. <laughs> oh, cavalry. All right, everybody go home. <laughs> They're like, fuck, the bar's gone out of hand. <laughs> <laughs> this is the average day when the Red Wings finally win a game. Oh, God. <laughs> In Detroit. <laughs> oh, shit. I love, they, this is, run- this is Missouri. We shoot first and ask questions later. Yep. <laughs> Not a single silver cop amongst them. Man, I stand corrected. I mean, they haven't got shot yet. That could still happen. Yeah. No, it could be a Night of the Living Dead ending. Yeah, they could be Ben. Yeah, they wanted to go to the full effect. You might want to say you're not one of them. Yeah, you, you might want to raise your hands. Announce yourselves. Yeah. Say you're not infected or whatever the hell. Or not. Whatever. Just take chances. Or say something. Anything. Hey, Cap. Is that who I think it is? John Wayne. God, man, I thought you were... It's the black cop. <laughs> no. So did I. It's the drunkard. Wait, he's... The... It's I mean, the I drunkard. He's infected. No. Even an EPA investigator disappeared. We found him and Mrs. Mate Sullivan. Yeah, this is like a nice blend of like other. Yeah, no, like, honestly, like this really isn't. This it's isn't it's a like movie. it's a Night of Living Dead, the crazies, like you know, mix. Yeah, that's mighty nice of you, Captain. Oh, by the way, I think you know where you can put this. <laughs> In the jukebox. <laughs> well, your favorite Hank Williams song. You want a drink? I love. It. So the moral of the story is always drink. <laughs> Cause he literally quit and shit started happening. And then remember he went back to the C B radio, started drinking again. Like, Drink wild turkey, have a shotgun. <laughs> yep. Damn it's a lot of cops. <laughs> no, like honestly, in all seriousness. Good movie. Yeah, it was it like, was a lot like it's not now, phenomenal. Here's the thing. If I went in this movie with expectations, I would be a little disappointed. Oh, great. But oh, the great. fact that we went in this movie with no expectations made it a little better. No, like, uh, and also, like, uh, on a... On a serious scale. I give it B. I would give it about a C+. Yeah, I, I, I don't know if I could watch it again. <laughs> uh, over, like, no, this is not going to be, like, like, Night of the Living Dead or Return of the Living Dead where I can watch it just for the fun of it or whatever. No. Right. But I could totally... If someone said, Hey, Kyle, uh, I found this movie. Do you recommend it? Yes. Give it a try. 
If you like, yeah. If yeah. somebody was like, I love a good. Because oh, here's the thing: you want to watch an '80s zombie movie, more than likely you're probably going to end up watching Dawn of the Dead. Agreed. There's not a whole lot of '80s zombie. Yeah, movies. agreed. Yeah, not good. Ones, if you want something different, and you're kind of like see, kind of sick of seeing Dawn of the Dead and Day of the Dead all the time. I I would watch it. Like like I said, yeah. this isn't garbage. If you're having a zombie marathon, I would probably throw it in there. Oh, great! No, absolutely. Like, uh, yeah, no, not bad. No, that was not at all what I thought it was going to be. Neither did I. I was expecting complete garbage. I can respect this movie. <laughs> yeah, which is not something we say that often. Yeah, I know, especially <laughs> out of a shit pile. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is up with that? Like, that was that was halfway decent. I'll respect this. Yeah. All right, guys. the uh, The next movie we're watching is called Six Days in Roswell, a documentary about aliens, or actually less about aliens and more about the Roswell incident and how weird people will get around it. Yeah. So, oh, shit. so stay tuned. We will be watching. We'll be right back.